What's up everybody? It is day 11 and today's movie is a true masterpiece of horror. Stanley Kubrick's The Shining. Now, I have a bit of a confession to make. For the longest time, especially when I was growing up, I didn't like this movie. Now, before you jump on me and shit, um, it's not because I thought it was a bad movie. It's because I was such a fan of the book that the fact that the movie isn't like the book at all kind of got to me a little bit. But, you know, as the years gone, have gone on. I, I've learned to accept that uh, this movie isn't anything like the book, the, the Stephen King book. And for anyone who, excuse me, for anyone who knows me, they know I'm a huge Stephen King fan, so. But, uh, yeah, for the longest time, I couldn't stand it, you know, I was like, well, why is Jack Nicholson running around already insane, like from the beginning? You know, to me, he looked insane from the beginning. But you know, I've come to learn that you know that's Jack Nicholson. That's just the way he is. He's he's like that in every fucking Jack Nicholson film. <laughs> every movie he's in, he's got this air of being crazy, which is is Jack Nicholson. He's in, it's just awesome. Uh. The acting from the, the child, I forget his name, the acting from the child uh, leaves a lot to be desired, uh, which is the case in like 85 to 90 percent of all movies that involve a child, and it's certainly the case in the TV remake, which a lot of people shit on, but I won't shit on because it was actually good, as opposed to some of the other TV remakes of Stephen King's books, so... I'm a bit flustered. <laughs> Excuse me. I spent all day putting this motherfucker together. Uh, this DVD shelf back here. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, yeah. And I still have to stock it, so... That's gonna take all day to stock it and... organize it and all that shit. Plus the rest of the room is a mess. Uh, and I'm on drugs. Yeah. Don't worry, it's prescription drugs, but, uh, I needed the painkiller. So, uh, I'm a, I'm a bit, uh, loopy, <laughs> as they say. Ah, oh, I was hoping I could pop that, but no. Anyway, back to The Shining. Wow, I went on a whole tangent on... Back to The Shining. Uh, this movie is awesome. I mean, it's truly a masterpiece. I mean, from everything, from the visuals to the sound, to uh, certain shots from the director. The way it's written, it's not, it's not, it's nothing like the book, so you can just get that out of your mind right now. Other than character names and settings, it is nothing like the book. Stop fucking judging it by that, alright? It's nothing like the book, and that's a good thing. It's a good thing, because if it was like the book, it wouldn't nearly be as good as it is now. And that's just wrong, to deprive... To deprive the world of something so awesome as The Shining... It's just wrong. So yeah. Um, it's been on a DVD, it's, I have it on Blu-ray. It looks amazing on Blu-ray, so pick it up. It's dirt-ass cheap. You have no excuses. If you haven't seen it yet, please fucking see it. Alright? Stop this video and go watch it. I'm dead serious. Go watch it, come back, and watch the ending three seconds of this video or however long it's gonna go on. I don't know. I'm done talking. I gotta stock this motherfucker, so... I'll see y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow's movie, yet to be determined, but it will be a classic, so watch out for that. Y'all take care.
See you later.